choosing the tunnel technique for me is also thinking of what kind of tissue we have around the recession. If we have um, good keratinization, thick tissue, apical recession, I can also do the procedure of a classical flap. If I have to deal with very thin gingiva phenotype, I rather prefer the tunnel technique for a better blood supply. I have to combine it with a subepithelial connective tissue graph because the, the graph will determine the keratinization later on. Therefore, the epithelial will be keratinized if we combine it with the graph, which also gives us a better long-term result because we have thicker gingiva, better keratinized, which is resistant also to mechanical issues and traumas.